Hello, what's up YouTube and welcome to this episode of Road to Professional DJ. Today you do join me on another gig vlog. Tonight I am playing for Disco's Revenge for our very, very, very first gig in Southampton. Tonight we're playing for Heartbreakers. Sorry, we're playing at Heartbreakers with Disco Revenge of course and it is our very first gig in that venue. Up to now we've been playing in essentially the back of a pub. So we want to try and maybe upscale a little bit, get things a little bit more professional, a little bit better of a business deal as well, which I'll cover with you guys in a short while. Um, so today, of course, you are following me along for that gig, but I also have some really, really other exciting news in the fact we have got some merch in for our boxed in brand. I'll show you it now. We've got these boxed in t-shirts um in fact i will show you one on boom ah is that backwards on the camera i can't quite tell if not i might have to flip it around but we have got some boxed in merch we're not really going to be making much money off these at all, but the idea is we want to be getting our brand out there as much as possible. There are people that have been following boxing for a lot longer than I've been working with them, and I think it is the sort of thing they would be interested in buying or owning or getting involved with. Um, and it's good for our brand. Maybe people are going to start asking um, when, when people are wearing who's boxed in, what are they? And that's going to help us with the marketing. So we've got a box of 40 that we're looking to ship. Um, if it is backwards on here, I can't quite tell, but we will be trying to ship those. Um, I will give you a proper update on what is going on tonight. I'm in a bit of a rush, so you'll catch me just before going into the venue in Southampton. Hello, what's up guys? So I've just turned up ready now in Southampton for my gig. Um, I've got a little bit more time now to explain what exactly is going on tonight. So we have got our first gig tonight in Heartbreakers. Um, we're making a bit of a move to Southampton because we think it's going to be a bit better um, for the brand, for the longevity of the brand. Southampton's a bit more of a buzz. Winchester's got some potential, but unfortunately the venues just aren't there for us at the moment. Um, and also it's quite hard to attract people. Um, to when there's not there's not an awful lot going on in the nightlife with the city um, so at least here there's a lot of people that are going out so we just need to attract them to come to our nights um, so this is our first gig in Southampton I've done a lot of gigs in Southampton with Boxed In um, so I know the area I know the market I know this has got potential we're doing our first gig at Heartbreakers tonight um, we've also got a lot better of a deal so I don't mind talking about little bits of financials and stuff um, but for our gigs at the railway inn we used to have to give a pound per ticket to um, the venue itself whereas this gig we're playing for four hours tonight and we're getting paid 75 pounds to do it on top of that we are going to get 10 percent of the bar money if we can get anything over a thousand pounds so the business case is a lot more there um, it's not all about the money of course but it means we can then refinance money into the brand itself um, so that's going to be better for us, um, or at least we hope so. So we're hoping tonight can be a big night for those reasons. Um, I hope that gives you sort of an, an interesting insight um, as to sort of what it's like trying to run these brands and push these brands from behind the scenes. So as I say, hopefully we'll have a busy night tonight. Not getting my expectations up too high because it's our first one, um, but we'll wait and see. The main thing is actually to just get on with the venue and impress the venue so we can come back again. Um, but hopefully it goes well. See you in there.
And there we go, guys. That was Disco's Revenge first ever gig in Southampton. And as you can see, it was a raging success. It was actually at one point one in, one out at the door. But actually, before I go any further, that song you did hear for the Disco Revenge montage of the footage of the night out was made by Disco's Revenge resident DJ, co-founder and one of four that run it, Mikey. It is linked under the Disco Revenge brand name. Um, you can see the full song and the link within the video below. It is one of the songs that is featured in the R2 PD Presents playlists. But going back to the matter in hand, that was our first gig in Southampton, the first one at Heartbreakers, and it went so, so well. We did get on really well with the promoter, the guy that was running those nights out at that bar. There is another brand that we're in competition with, so they're having their gig next weekend, and then they're gonna see which one they wanna take forward. To be honest, we can't really do a lot better from that. We were one in, one out of the door, we got on really well, we acted professionally, we acted friendly, so what more can you do from that point of view? I don't know. Um, it was also really good from a financial point of view. As I was saying, we got paid £75 for the gig and then we made about £100 profit from the bar as well. So all in all, it was a really successful night. Hopefully that will be one of many at Heartbreakers in Southampton because it works. It works for the brand as well because we enjoy our music, but we don't take life too seriously and that sort of venue really represents that. It's not necessarily all the bells and all the whistles, but it is a venue that we can work with going forward. As I say, it was a super successful night and hopefully one Disco's Revenge can use as a stepping stone and build upon into the future. Other things going on with the channel at the moment, I have just made a big push reaching out for some mentors. So I have at least three guys interested in doing some mentoring. If you want mentoring, it's free. Get in touch with me. I want to help some guys out there. That's something we've got going on with this channel at the moment. One of the guys is actually from New York City, so just being able to to reach out to someone as far away as New York City for someone based in the UK is amazing. Hopefully I can help some of these guys make it from bedroom to club DJ because that's what I have been so successful in doing in the short time I've been running this channel Road to Professional DJ. This time last year I never even had a gig in the UK. Um, it's literally mainly all taken off in the last six months which has been absolutely unbelievable. So I'm looking forward to that mentoring and perhaps uploading um, some feedback feedback or some progress reviews on these guys as well onto the YouTube but don't even know at the moment I just want to help some guys so that would be amazing. I do want to get 10 people from bedroom to club DJ that is a goal of mine so fingers crossed that can happen. Also as I mentioned with that Disco's Revenge uh, tune that we had on a moment ago if you are a producer and you want to upload your music onto my channel let me know. Doesn't matter whether you're signed or not I'm interested in getting up and coming producers to feature on my channel and hopefully give you guys a bit more exposure. Looking forward, I've got loads of cool stuff going on. I will actually quickly show you this, which if the lighting shows are right, because I did focus all the lighting in this side of the room, but I have got a radio show or a few radio shows lined up. You can see a link to a mix that I've just done for Goat Shed Radio. That was more of a live stream mix, but I should be working on a couple of radio shows as well. So lots of cool stuff going on with this channel at the moment. Hopefully, me sharing it with you guys gives you guys ideas as to what you could be doing. But that's just about it from this episode of Road to Professional DJ. Please give it a thumbs up if you did like this video. And of course, subscribe for more good stuff coming soon. Cheers.